boxes, boxes, boxes. Guys, we've been doing big things behind the scenes here at the BB Compound, but I can't keep up with my projects. We got boxes everywhere. And with that being said, let's go ahead and load up the boxes into the truck and knock out some of the projects that gotta get done. So I just opened that box right there and I had a little bit of a surprise because I did not order this but it is here. We got an $800 Sig Sawyer scope, 3 by 18 Check this joker out. I mean it's actually a really nice scope. Like I said, it's an $800 scope and I didn't order it. My name's on the package and my address but I did not order it and it's also a used scope but the company Sig did send it. You can tell it's used just from all the beating it's had. What do you think Garrett? I don't know dude. How? Do you, how? Why? <laughs> well, that's actually dope because I actually have a rifle I can throw this on. Let me go grab it. Now, I actually got this uh, Remington 700. It's a 6.5 Creedmoor. I seen it at uh, my buddy Anton's, his gun store. I picked it up for $475. I mean, that is dirt cheap. Check that thing out. Let's just grab the scope real quick. Let's just see what that thing's going to look like. Oh, yeah. That'll be perfect. I can see it already. Well, I guess this gun finally got a scope and it's going to come out of the closet. <laughs> let's go ahead. Let's load up the rest of the stuff. Well, boys, we have made it. We are down at the Deer Club. The home away from home. The home away from home, like Garrett just said. We've been doing a lot down here over the last, I don't know, two or three months. We remodeled the entire inside, cleaned up some outside stuff, even got the skin and shed and the grill back. We got everything over here looking pretty much right, A-OK, -okay, new lights, everything you can think of. If you haven't watched that video, you need to go check it out. But let's go on in here. Let's walk into the clubhouse. Let's talk about what all we got to do today. Later in this video, I'll get into what I'm doing behind the scenes that's going to be insane if it happens. It is it's a little cold in here, ain't it? It's a little brisk. <laughs> Let's go ahead, turn on the lights. Here's my bedroom. The only thing we gotta do in here is we gotta build a ladder to get to the top bunk. Go over to the kitchen. We gotta put in a washer and dryer, get this trash out of here. Yes, you heard me, a washer and dryer in the clubhouse. We got some new mattresses and other kinds of stuff. We gotta hang on the walls, mirrors, towel holders, that kind of stuff. And again, we gotta put ladders on these bunk beds in here. This is mine, right here. Do what? This is mine. That's yours? This is mine. Oh yeah? Yeah. But with that being said, let's go ahead, cut in the montage. Guys, sit back and enjoy watching the progress. finished all the ladders up to the top bunks. Garrett, what you think? That's a hell of a lot better than jumping on Bobby down below to get up here. We got this one built right here, you know, simplistic as can get. Same with that one over there. That wood's kind of uh, not in great shape. We had to run with the wood we had on the trailer that was already here. Got this one in here already built. Now we do gotta paint all these. I also need to let the wood dry out because it's a little wet. Garrett, what else did you do? Uh, I see you done tore open a box. Yeah, I put the top mattress up. New mattress, baby. Check that out. Now we just gotta get a mattress there. And then once we do that, all the mattresses are here. Yeah. 
all six mattresses. That's a lot of people in this place. We can sleep 10 people. Oh, easily sleep 10 people. Honestly, more than that. Two, three, four, six, no, five, six, no. Seven, eight, nine. Nine, ten, ten eleven. 11. Oh, yeah. Twelve with an air mattress. We can sleep twelve people. It's pretty dope. Now, for my bed in here, I actually got me a uh, memory foam mattress topper. It's gotta be bougie. This bed's already really comfortable, but memory foam is gonna be nice. We gotta hang some big heaters while we are here. We need to hang this mirror while we're here. Get the rest of the mattresses in here. Get the washer and dryer, which I'll be showing you guys that soon. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and start kicking ass so we can get all this stuff done and uh, show you guys the final product. That's a level. It is level. You said eyeball it. Your when fault. Your fault. It, your fault. It, I thought you had eyes to begin with. I do. Two of them. 20 to 20 lazy boots. No, you don't. That's level. Not even close. Look. Ready? Watch. Problem Watch. solved. Problem solved. Well, damn, that looks pretty damn level to me. I found something that will fing roll. Like the big ass head of yours? Put it on there. It'll roll down. That looks level. Then again, we are at a fucking clubhouse. So, what do you expect? Look at it from Who cares? And just like that, our chores are done, and now it's time to have some fun. Garrett, buddy, what are you getting into tonight? Oh, uh, I don't know. I think you're gonna put me on my first bow kill ever, actually. First deer ever? First deer ever. Yep, with a bow. With a bow. That's pretty, my bow. That's pretty high stuff right Yeah, there. it should be a good night. Garrett actually got this bow while we were in uh, Illinois, right? Yep. Got this bear, and you've been shooting it a lot since. Yeah, best little $600 yep. bow you could ask for. And now he's ready to go kill a deer with it. It's kind of a rainy, groggy day. It's actually the next day from us doing all our chores. We got all the mattresses in. We got the washer and dryer in. We got all the ladders built. Girls, yeah, you're staying here and hanging out. Yeah. Bree. Morgie's dying. Hopefully. Yeah, we don't really know. Garrett just got done practicing. Good now day. it's Bree's turn to practice I'll shooting her bow. Last time we were down here, she was shooting amazing. Garrett's probably going to be launching an arrow at a deer, probably 30 yards. Bree, if her buck comes in, 20 yards we hope. But the wind's perfect for both stands tonight, so uh, only hope for the best. All right, we got a chair set up for Bree at 25 yards down to the deer target. Do you think you're going to smoke it? I hope. You hope. All right, Bree, there's only a million people watching, two million people, so uh, see what you got. The pressure's on. That right there is Forky. So she the hole? Yeah, sure. Aim for the hole in target. Center mass of that block. Let's see it. Little low. Uh -oh. Just a little low. She hit left and right perfect, but she hit about five inches low. Luckily, the deer's gonna be at 20, but she was shooting out to 30 in groups like that last time we were here. Let's see it. Center punch it. Okay, your bow's grouping a little low. When I shot her bow at 30 the other day, it was hitting really low for no reason, but her 20 pin is still dead on. Look at this group she just put out. That ain't bad at all. But she is aiming here, it is just hitting low. That's close enough, the deer's gonna drop into it. And if not, 20 yards, she should be dead on. So uh, I'm gonna let her shoot that a little bit, and then we're gonna pick you guys up when we're headed to the stand. Oh, we are rolling up to the first spot. Right back in there. Garrett, buddy. Yes. You gonna smack one? I'm gonna smack Addison's one. actually going too. Woo! You actually gonna film for him? Yeah. You gonna, gonna do try. a good job? Yeah. We'll I see how this goes. Good luck. Can I bring it up to Pepper? We're dropping them off. <laughs> we're dropping them off at this stand and me and Bree, we're gonna run up to the stand that we got Forky at, this deer right here, and uh, see if we can't smack him. Lord help me. I don't know if I can do this. Don't lose too many brain cells. We'll see it. Let's go, baby. Boy, we made it back here with the truck. It was uh, quite the mess. The truck's pretty dirty now, but uh, we'll deal with that later. We're gonna walk in here, hop up in the stand and see if we can't kill Forky. We're going after Forky, baby. How many hunts have we went on for Forky? A lot. We have seen this deer two times. Both times, second time, definitely could have killed him with a rifle, but uh, trying to get it done with the bow. That'd be her first bow kill ever. She got this bow three weeks ago. So uh, if we can make this happen, it's gonna be awesome. Yeah, I'll probably cry. <laughs>
boys, we have made it up in the stand. We got Bree ready. She is ready to rock and roll. Bo is ready. I actually got her this bow for Christmas and she has been shooting it ever since. Yes, I know it's not Christmas yet. I gave it to her early just to kill this deer. So uh, hopefully it all comes together. Garrett should be trying to get his first bow kill tonight. And uh, I have high hopes for him. I don't know if we're gonna shoot. The camera has been down here for the last week, but uh, a week and a half ago, this deer was here every morning on the dot. And we came in and hunted him on a bad wind that he got out of Dodge, but back in here hunting him. You got anything to say? I hope he comes in. You hope? Yeah. Let's get it. See if we can't kill him. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. What happened? Oh, you know, I can make excuses, but truth is the deer was about 12 yards and I put the 20 pin on him and slung the some bitch and it went right over. Yeah, I'm ready to watch this footage, see how much of that's true. Oh, I swear. Oh my goodness. Well, boys, we're heading back to the clubhouse. Uh, we got Joe making us chili, so yep. we're going to hang out at the clubhouse and uh, eat some chili and I'm just going to pick you guys up there and uh, let Garrett go into uh, what happened. We might have to pull up the instant playback. Well, I'll show you. All right, boys, we got the fire going. Joe's in the house cooking chili for us. Garrett, can you please explain? Explain yourself. Well, you see what had happened was it got dark. Yeah. The range finder wasn't working. Yeah. The light and knock didn't go off. Blah, blah, blah. The deer was at 15, yeah. maybe 10. Yeah. Put it on 20 and it just... Uh -huh. right Addison, you were there. Yeah. How much of that's lying? All of it. All of it. Did you lose brain cells in the blind? Because I'm not blaming you. I lost one. What? There had to be a quote from Addison. What was her quote of the night? What if we see a zebra? <laughs> Where do zebras come from? <laughs> but guys, I'm gonna go ahead and close off this video so we can go ahead and enjoy the rest of the weekend here. We are hunting tomorrow morning, so if we kill one, you guys will be seeing that. We got the fire going. Should be good. About to eat dinner. If you guys would, hit the thumbs up button, like, and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. Yeah.